I saw my truck was there perfectly fine. This morning, my boss came and it was gone. Mahendra Monadad says on Monday night, he parked his tractor trailer on Springfield Boulevard like he has done after many shifts. All the other trucks were there too. But when he returned the next day, it was gone. The commercial vehicle had been towed by police along with dozens of others that were parked there illegally. As part of Operation Heavy Duty Enforcement, officers have targeted multiple locations across Southern Queens. I want to cry. I want to cry because you got to pay over $2,000 just to get my truck off on the lot. This video shared on Twitter by the mayor's office shows the trucks being towed. Last week, the NYPD issued 597 summonses and towed 55 illegally parked vehicles. Mayor Eric Adams was on hand with the NYPD and Department of Transportation to send a message to truckers that he says are turning neighborhoods in New York into illegal parking lots. This has been a problem and it's not about going after an industry is about having an industry no not going after a community large commercial vehicles are prohibited from parking on residential streets overnight between the hours of 9 p.m. and 5 a.m. seven days a week but people in Springfield Gardens say truckers have been breaking that rule for years it is a big concern because you have the cemetery there and even for the people who come to bury their dead they can't get parking because the trucks are, you know, take up all the parking space. The trucks were moved to a temporary lot. The truckers tell PIX11 the towing mission is unfair because it was unannounced and it's hard to find parking for large commercial vehicles. Clothes, food, water, drinks, that's where, that's where we're dropping off. When the city needed us, we was there. During COVID-19, when they needed us, we was there. But now they're doing us very wrong about it.